Emilia Banana. Oh, that's great. A monkey. Okay, let's wait for them a little while. Let's wait for the rest of your classmates to join the room. Oh, May 30, I will miss you, teacher Diana. I will miss you all. Teacher, can I drink water? Can you also take time? Oh. I'll be like, can you also pick the teacher and call and text? Uh huh. What did you say? Can we like text and FaceTime if we are going to another school until the school ends? Mm. Also? Yes. Mm. Because you, you will, you will be, you will. You will be with your new teacher now in grade three. Are you excited to be in grade three? You all I can excited? My, I can meet my old classmates there, right there. Uh. Wait, my daughter is beside a C. <laughs> Anyways, um. So those who have not yet complied the rest of the requirements, like the videos, uh, the seat works, and other projects that I gave, kindly comply it, please. Because um, we're about to make the grades for the third quarter. Hey, teacher, thank you for teaching us very hard. You're the best teacher. Aw, that is so sweet. Don't worry, your next teacher will also be nice. Yeah, last time when it's my first day in second grade, and then when you're teaching me for days, I said to my father that he's the best teacher. Uh -uh. Okay, let's start now. Okay, so where are they? Hello. Yes, hello. Teacher Diana, do you know every night I do modules? Every night? Yeah. That's great. But don't you need to sleep at night? Last night I just No, because Zach is a mon Zach is a vampire. He don't sleep at night. <laughs> I'm lo I'm I'm locking my doors and closing my window before he bites my neck. Well I'm sleeping. <laughs> I have wings if you are a vampire you have wings. Oh. <laughs> me, Zach, I will bring your key. But don't bite me, it hurts. Okay, so let's start now. Let's take a look. Okay. Right, so. Hello once again. Great to you. Hello. Hello. And welcome back to our um, class. English class. Right, so today we're going to review the kinds of sentences that we have learned last time. So last time we've learned about the four types of sentences, right? You have the telling sentence. So what is telling sentence? To tell them. Uh -huh. Okay, so telling sentence is you give a statement or a fact, a 
okay? Okay, so it's it's actually like real, like what you actually share, information that you shared. Example, you have the leaves looks fresh and clean. The rooms were empty. Okay, what else can you give? Another example, anyone? Are, are making a nest, teacher me. Me, I want to answer, please. I'm making it. Okay, let's start with Eliza. Where are we going today? Wait, telling sentence, not asking. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wait. The birds fly away in the sky. Yes. B. The birds fly away of the sky, Liza said. Okay, how about Zach? Me. Um, me. The lion was eating meat. The lion? The lion was running away from the cheetah. Okay. Next, Abby. Okay. The airplane is landing. The airplane is landing. Hmm. What yeah. else? Okay, Seth. I will play Roblox later after school. I will play <laughs> Roblox after the class. Okay. Next, what else? Anyone? Um, yes, Sean. Yeah, no. Huh, Sean? I'll do. I'm going to play with my friends later. Okay, can be. All right, so those are the examples of. Those are examples of telling sentences. Give um statement or fact, okay? And it ends with a period. Next. Number two, an asking question. An asking sentence, I mean. So asking sentence, ask questions, and it ends with a question mark. Example, where are the puppies? Did you see the rat? Okay, what else? Where is your mom? Where is your mom? Are you when going home next week? Gonna end? Huh? Are you going home next Where's week? Are you going home <laughs> next week? What else? When is the virus gonna end? When is the virus? Virus or pandemic? Or when is the pandemic gonna end? What else? Where are my glasses? Where are my glasses? What's inside the box? What food are you eating? Yes? And I am gonna make your food. Where is the puppy going? Where is the puppy going? Mm -hmm. Can be. When are you gonna hang the clothes? Mm -hmm. When are you gonna hang the clothes? Okay. So those are some examples of asking sentence. And it always ends with a question mark. Question mark. Next, number three. So next. Number three, you have a commanding sentence. So what is a commanding sentence? Commanding um, sentence gives command or request. Example, you have get inside the house now. Please open the door. Okay, what else? Please bring the popcorn for the movie. Good job. Can be. What else? Run to the store. Can you run to the store? Can you run to the, Clean the house, please? Clean yeah. the house, please. Can you run to the store? Please, I please. please make food. 
Huh? Please, please help hmm. me clean my room. Uh -huh. Help me clean my room. Can be. Please make food. Please make food for me. Can be. Okay, so those are the commanding sentence. Next, you have the an exclaiming um sentence. So exclaiming mm -hmm. sentence it expresses strong feeling and it ends with exclamation point, exclamation mark. Okay, so you have example. I won. That. <laughs> what a pleasant surprise! Okay. Sure. Hooray! 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 You're welcome. Mm -hmm. You can also say thank you. Happy birthday. Merry Christmas. All right. So those are the exclaiming sentences. Now always remember to use the following called punctuation marks. You have the period, question mark, and exclamation mark. All right. So this time, let's study the following, then complete the chart. So you have here, the water is cool. Is the water cool? Have you noticed? The water yeah. is cool. Is the water cool? So what punctuation mark is used for this one? What punctuation mark is used? Okay, so this time I want you to get your paper and your whiteboard. If you don't have paper, you can use whiteboard. I want you to copy this chart and complete the following. Provide what is being asked. Answer and write your answer in the chart. Yeah, I'm confused a little bit because I don't know what to do there. So let me explain it now. I'm still confused. Are we going to follow that, like make our own sentence and then read it? No, you're gonna copy. Oh, you're gonna copy all of it. Oh, like the water is cool. The water is mm -mm. cool. Teacher, can I be? Okay. Sir, what can we do again? Mm. 
again, Sofia. All right, are you all done? Let's let's check. Do you copy the whole thing, teacher? The one in the screen? Yes. But if you don't know how, it's okay if you're not going to copy it. You just have to copy the sentence. This one. And this one. The questions. Then write your answer next to the question. Yes. Next is answer the following questions here. What punctuation mark is used? What punctuation mark is used? What does that mean, teacher? What punctuation? Here you what have what, what what punctuation mark is being used in the following sentences? I already know what that means. Mm. Based on what we have discussed earlier, what are the punctuation marks that is being used in this sentence? What kind of Sentence is this. What third is cool? What kind of sentence is this? Uh... I'm done. All right, if Hello. you're done, let's check now. Let's check the following. What part are you now, Abby? I'm I am in the part of what kind of sentence is this? Okay. Already done, by the way. What? Pyron, are you done, Pyron? Why are you not answering?
Teacher, I have a band called the Sabor. Mm, are you done, Johan? Okay, good job. How about Maika? I'm done. I get done. Only one that's done. How about Natalia? Are you finished? Natalia? Aldez, are you finished, Aldez? Not yet. All right, so let's check now. Don't have enough time. Okay. Okay, so I'm here. Okay, I'm done. So you have the water is cool. Is the water cool? So what punctuation mark is used in this sentence? The water is cool. So this one we use is period. Um, um, the period. 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 And the second one we use is question mark, question mark, question, question mark. mark. Question mark. The question, question mark is right there in the other pool. Yes. Next. So what kind of sentence is this? Telling sentence. Telling sentence. We have telling sentence. And the other one is asking sentence. Good job. It is asking sentence. So what water. is the first word of the sentence? The, 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 is, 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 Okay, so you have here, it's all correct. Okay, you have telling sentence and asking sentence, right? So for the following, the two sentences in the chart contain the same words. It's just that they have different type of um, positioning of the word. So the other part, the other um, kind of sentence here is asking and the other one is telling. So we use is, are, was, where for the first word. And using a question mark at the end of the asking sentence. You have another example. So you have the bird is building nest. Is the bird building a nest? So, so what you have noticed, this one right here, the first um, sentence is telling and the second one is asking question. Then the next one you have the doc are swimming are the ducks swimming my friend was absent was my friend absent some children were resting were some children resting so these are types of examples and we're gonna discuss more about this next class right it's going a first alarm mm -mm. okay so Please answer the sit work in the LMS for the math in English if you have, um, I mean, after the class. Now, um, we'll see each other again later in Filipino class. So let's say goodbye for now, everyone. Bye bye. Goodbye and see you in Filipino class. Yes, Seth? Hey, it's okay, I think. Okay.
Okay. All right. We'll see each other again later. Goodbye. Bye-bye, teacher. Thank you. Bye. Bye.